start putting together some content that's uh, more than just cool trucks going up and down to truck shows. I want to get back to why I invented this system and why I started this company, right? So we're here at Any Level Lift World Headquarters and we've got a new 2020 Limited F450 in the house that we're about to tear down and uh, get the suspension out. But before we did that, I wanted to show you guys what the traditional means were for holding the body of a truck centered over an axle, right? Because that's a big piece of an adjustable suspension and what makes us uh, as a company so unique in the industry because nobody else can do what we do in respect to that. So if you come up front here and check this out. So we're up in the front looking up under the skirt of this F450. So I could show you what a traditional panhard bar looks like. So uh, this is also referred to as a track bar and it's attached here at the frame over on the driver's side. And then it comes down and it's attached to the axle on the passenger side. The purpose of this bar is to hold the axle in position from side to side underneath the truck. Because this is simply a straight bar, it travels in an arc as the truck goes up and down. This is true for hitting bumps or on any other adjustable suspension system on the market. This arc results in side to side motion as the truck goes up and down. The factory does a decent job of minimizing this effect by keeping the bar horizontal or relatively horizontal. However, when you lift a truck, that angle becomes more extreme which in turn amplifies the amount of side to side motion of the body. When you buy a lift kit, oftentimes it'll come with a track bar drop bracket to help again, try to minimize that angle, um, which, which works fine on static lift kits with a fixed ride height because they only have to deal with that arc when you hit bumps. However, if you want to have any sort of significant adjustment, um, that uh, side to side motion can really affect your alignment. So if you want any sort of significant up and down gain, the traditional pan hard bar just simply isn't going to work. You might get away with a couple of inches, but you can ask your wife if she's cool with that. So what do we do? How do we solve the problem? Well, you know, I've seen Watts linkages be used on, on the rear ends of some hot rods and race cars, but something like that just isn't gonna fit within the space constraints up here in the front of the truck. So there's also a triangulated four link that can be used to, to keep the body centered throughout the range. In fact, that's what we do in the back of the truck, but that alone uh, with, with the steering forces that we have up front and the, tr and the prying action of those steering forces, you can't get away with just that triangulation in the front. So that's where our patented panhard mechanism comes into play. So let me show you what that's all about. So we're up under the front of this any level truck now, so I can uh, talk through how that patented panhard mechanism works. And don't mind this mechanism up front. This is for the steering. We're gonna cover that uh, on another day. So. This mechanism in the back, that's, that's performing the same function as the traditional panhard bar I just talked about. It's connected up here at the driver's side of the frame to the factory mount. There's a long link that comes down and it's connected to this slider over here on the passenger side of the axle. That's allowed to move horizontally. There's a linear bearing in there. So there's also this short link that's connected in the center of the long link and then down to this custom axle bracket. This is actually where all the forces are that are holding the axle side to side under the truck. Now the way this works is as the truck goes up and down, it travels in a straight line from here at the frame mount down to the axle mount. So that folds up on itself and it kicks out over here on the passenger side. That is what allows the body to stay centered over the axle throughout the whole range of motion.